Le Mans it's a very special race. It's uh, probably one of the most important races in the world. So it's always special for us, for the team, for the drivers and also for the sponsors. So it's a pressure, a lot of pressure and uh, we try to, uh, to stay quiet and cool and to do the job like uh, the other races but uh, it's very difficult a lot of stress but we try to uh, prepare the car to do the job of course uh, we have to push during 24 hours because the level is very high in LMP2 and uh, last year we finished second this year we hope to uh, to win the race but Le Mans we we never know we never know, and we can't uh, we can't really uh, prepare this race. Uh, it's it's special, special. Le Mans, it's special for everybody, but especially for the French guy, of course, because a lot of people is coming, the friends, the family. So of course it's uh, it's different, but uh, it's special because a lot of pressure, a lot of pressure because it's it's important for the sponsors and. Uh, a lot of things, I think it's uh, like the Everest for an alpinist. Uh, we want to, to win this race. Uh, I think it's important for, for Dallop and uh, for, for everybody to, to work on the car. Well, I transfer, I have, a, of course, yes, a lot of experience in Seagull Center, but the endurance was different a few years ago, but now there is not so much difference because now the level and the reliability of the cars is really high. So now, for example, for the 24 hours of Le Mans, you have to push the first lap until the last one. It's like the single seater. And now if you stay on the car two hours, three hours, you have to push three hours. So the training and physically and mentally is, is quite hard because uh, it, it's like the single seater during one hour but you stay on the car three hours or maybe four hours. It's quite tough. There is no big difference now between the endurance and the single-seater.